In this episode, 10 dog breeds that are suitable for the military. The use of dogs in the military isn't something new, and according to historians, this might have happened for the first time around 600 BC. But over time, dogs took on more tasks in the battlefield such as transporting artillery, sending messages, patrolling, destroying enemy formations, detecting, and of course attacking. No matter how much technology is developed, it was always impossible to replace dogs. So powerful and sophisticated militaries around the world, besides to advancing the technologies they use, are also advancing dog training methods in order to use as much as possible the true potential of some breeds. Of all the breeds around the world, some are among the favorites that militaries consider them the most valuable. One of them is Giant Schnauzer. The German military has used this breed in both world wars as a sentry and tracking dog, but their contribution extends to other militaries of the world also. It's said that Air Force One has assessed that these dogs don't have the appropriate temperament to work in the military, however, such a breed is still used in this department. Rottweiler This dog was used as a guard dog in the First World War to guard at night and to alert soldiers if he had seen any enemy forces. Their use today is less common, but it's thought that the U.S. military uses Rottweilers in its intimidation and interrogation tactics. German Short-Haired Pointer Since he's bred for hunting, the German Short-Bred Pointer has a very developed sense of smell. This dog is the first breed in the history of the British military to detect electronic communications devices such as cell phones, voice recorders, SIM cards, and GPS devices. For this work, they're still used in this country. Moscow Watchdog The Moscow Watchdog is a well-known breed in its country of origin, but almost unheard of in the wider world. This is because he was created to fill a specific place in the Russian military as an intimidating guard dog that was very easy to train. Black Russian Terrier the Black Russian Terrier was bred to scare with his size, attitude, and demeanor. This breed was developed by the Soviet government in the 1930s to protect wartime military camps as well as to patrol prisons. Even today, this dog is used in the Russian military and especially in the duty of the Guardian. Labrador Retriever you wouldn't expect a dog like a Labrador Retriever to be on this list, let alone be considered a soldier. However, the task of this dog in the U.S. Armed Forces is a bit different than that of other breeds. Labrador Retrievers are used by combat tracker teams to control the stress of soldiers deployed on battlefields. Bloodhound Although created and much more popular in Europe, in terms of military work, this dog is mostly used in America. Their most advanced sense of smell in the dog world is used by the U.S. military to sniff out enemy soldiers, as well as stockpiles of narcotics and weapons. Dutch Shepherd Utilized by the Germans in World War II because of its strong working qualities, their use has expanded to other parts of the world, and today they're used more by the U.S. military for guarding and protecting military assets and personnel. German Shepherd this dog is one of the most common to be used in the military, and its use extends all over the world. But what makes him so, apart from intelligence and strength, is the fact that he adapts to almost any climatic condition more than many other dog breeds. Belgian Malinois The career of this breed in the military began in the First World War when they were used as messengers and helped to find wounded soldiers. The breed is lighter than a German Shepherd, therefore he's more suitable to travel in military vehicles or to parachute in the areas of operations, and for this reason, they're becoming the most favorite breed in the military. That was all. Until next time, stay safe. See ya!